Hey guys, and welcome back to The Witcher 3. If you missed the last episode, poor old Priscilla had been attacked. Um, so, what's this round here? Yeah, what's this up here? Yeah, poor Priscilla had been attacked. Oh. And we need to figure out who. Right. Damn, they're like, brutalised. This is not Triss's house. Huh. Oops. Oh well. Hmm. Talk to Eustace. You Eustace, the corpse collector? I? How'd you know? Fourth sense, I think it is. You bring Fabian Meyer's body to the morgue. Fabian. Oh yeah, I remember. <laughs> No ice, no art. One of them, right? No purse neither, as I recall. Hmm, sure. Uh, collect the other bodies with those injured? Oh, injuries? So there have been other bodies like that? <laughs> sure have. Beggars, street urchins, and street walkers. One went so portly, I had to cut her into pieces to fit her in me wheelbarrow. Slippery sow, they called her, when I count her. Uh, <laughs> wow, okay. Some things are best left unsaid. What happened to the pieces? What do you mean? Reverend Nathaniel ordered them burned. Every last one. Oh, shame that was. Shame? Why? Actually, never mind. Another thing that's best left unsaid. Yep. Uh, you searched him. You searched Fabian's body? Well, I uh, cast an eye in his pockets. <laughs> Made sure nothing went to waste. I call a spade a spade. You rob corpses. And I call a prick a prick. It's none of your fucking concern. What, are you a tax collector? Peace off, mutant. Oh, let's fuck him up. Um, yeah, I'd advise you not to piss me off. I'd advise you not to anger me, or you'll get an inside tour of the crematory. Touch me, the guys will be hiding your ass for you can't free. To save a little shit like you? Doubt it. He's clever, <laughs> lads. More cleverer than you. They know use this. No, they want me on their side. Cause you'll all die one day, and then I'll decide where your body winds up. A grave, the crematorium, or elsewhere. Is he trying to threaten me? Huh. Oh, I don't want to be back. Oh, I'm going to have to pay him, god damn it. That hard up for coin? Fine, have some. Now talk. What did you find on him? Triflings, baubles, glass beaded wing, handful of coins, and a letter. Look, vellum, quality parchment, that. <laughs> I wipe off the right inner cell, it is new. That's human skin. Priscilla, next victim's name. If you'd given this to the right person, she might not have been hurt. <laughs> what the fuck do I care what happens to some Priscilla? We sure are wenches in this town. Oh, let's hurt him. Hit him, yep. Yep. Boy, fucking hell. What was that for? For everything. Yep, fuck him up. Right. I guess now we're going to this one. I think we should have stabbed him. That's what I really wanted to do. Really just, like, cut his arms off or something. We didn't need him. This town doesn't need him. Arsehole. Right. Where else do we need to go? That's around here. Okay. That's it. Excellent. Hi, have you got anything to say? No? Fuck. Oh, oh, oh. What's all this? No. Nope. My god. Come on, Geralt. Easier. This time of year. How am I to know? Watch him, see what he does. Who? Wait, who's? Oh, come on. Why are they trying to fight me? Lost your nerve. My God. Okay. Why are they trying to fight me? Come on. My god. 
Come on. That's it. Come on. Hell yeah. Oh, now there's you as well. Great. Come on then. Why are they... I don't understand. What have I done? Come on. There you go. Think you'll get me too, huh? Up your ass, Deviant. Holes can fight back. Uh. What is going on? I'm not gonna hurt you. What are you doing here? Getting vengeance. Well, why are you staring? Have you not heard killers always return to the scene of their crime? Me and my brothers are waiting here to give him a warm welcome for Priscilla. Almost did her in the whole sun. I know. Here to look for clues and find anyone who might know something. Fear I can't help you much. But I can tell you what I know. Sure. You and Priscilla friends? Friends? Nah. But she saw more than a stupid whore in me. Treated me with a respect. It mattered. I was looking to give up whoring. Pick up a decent trade. But none would take me. Not as a washerwoman, nor a servant, nor a cook. Felt like a leper, I did. But Priscilla, she was different. Agreed to put me in her play, you see? Lots that of the nice. other actors, they were afraid on account of her jesting about the eternal fire. Whistling Wendy on stage, can you imagine it? Well, dream's gone now. I'm back to work in street corners. Sorry to hear that. You could do worse as work goes. Or so I tell myself. I mean, you could, let's be fair. Priscilla wasn't the sole victim. You aware of that? Oh, dearie. Of course I was. <laughs> this didn't start yesterday. Others have died like this before. Beggars, street girls, orphans. But who'd have a drama concern about them? Human rubbish. It's what the guards call us. Recall any names? They didn't have proper ones. Baldy, curly, buns. That's what folk called them. No friends, no families. Their bodies were burned long ago. Right, okay. Uh, farewell, I guess. Take care now. I gotta look around some more. Appreciate it if you didn't disturb me. Naturally. We'll stand aside, behave. But do tell us if you find anything else here. I mean, you did get three men to try and beat me up. I don't think you deserve anything. Right. Come on. I hate how fiddly this can be sometimes. We'll come back for that one. Human. Priscilla's. I mean, we've got a footstep. I didn't mean to do that shit. Come on. My god. Okay. He just wants me to steal. I don't want to steal. No. That way. God damn. Here we go. Formaldehyde. And there's one little footstep. Man's footprint. The murderer's maybe. Weighed on his heel. Took a step back. Sounds citizens a sermon. Hmm. Oh, we can follow the footsteps. Oh, can we? Wait, is he the one that he's the one that put up the sign? Is he? I can't tell. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Murderer fled before the guards arrived. Ran this way. Trail ends here. Strange. Even I couldn't jump this wall. Huh. Got huh. Okay. So, what is it? Uh, I think I know what happened here. I think I know what happened here. Priscilla fought back, her assailant retreated, and knocked over the brazier. Someone must have heard it, maybe saw something, started hollering. The guard showed up. Murderer didn't finish the job, didn't cover his tracks. Just collected himself and leapt over the wall. The trail ends there. You divined all this from a pile of rubbish and a few prints in the mud? Do that practically every day in my profession. And practice <laughs> makes perfect. True enough. Just like I can tell right off if a pent will pay or try to wriggle out of it. That particular skill I could use myself. <laughs> True. Take care now. And I got a murderer to catch. Yes, we do. 
Right. Oh, only 70 feet to go. Cool. We can just jog there. Okay, and this is where the woodcarver died. Awesome. Oh. Oi, Witcher! Coroner wants to see you. Been another victim. Told Already. Told me to say the main door will be open for you. You ought to come as soon as you can. Right, okay. They're dying so quickly. Let's examine this place first. Where did the woodcarver die? How do I get inside? Come on, let me in. Anyone home? Be gone, or I'll set me hands on you. Molly, Striga, come! Relax, I'm here about Fabian Meyer, looking for his killer. That's altogether different. Set you stupid much light down. Come on, come on in. Slowly now, you're listening by me. Hi, dude. Uh, charming creatures. Charming as beasts go. You daft. Even I'm scared of them. A better barking dog than an evil man at your door. True. You got someone particular in mind? Sure as shite. Bugger who did Fabian in. As soon as they'd hauled his corpse off, I run to a meat or is his fighting dogs. Bought these two mutts. Cost me a chunk of change. But I sleep sound at least. Well, at least that's that. So who might you be? The Steph's brother. Dust is the name. We ran a workshop together. Meyer and Meyer. Hmm. Damn, they are Maybe angry. Now. Just Meyer. Name it. I'll be closing it down now. As soon as I find a bear for this shack, I'll head on to Mahakam. Be near my family or what's left of it. So, what do you want to know? What can I tell you about Fabian? Um, yeah, your brother have any enemies? Your brother have any enemies? Anyone dislike him? Threaten him, maybe? It was Fabian who threatened this one last. Oh, you were a good dwarf, craftsman like no other. But you were an incorrigible whoremonger as well. Whenever we put a bit of coin aside, I'd say, let's buy some tools, quality timber. No, he grabbed the purse and head out whoring. <laughs> Took to falling one in particular. He'd say, it's all your fault, dirty bitch, human dish rag. And other obscenities. Don't rightly know what that was about. Maybe he was in love with her. Know where I can find her, this dish rag? City Cemetery. She died a few days back, quietly in her sleep. Her pawn said a fever took her. Right, okay. Tell me what you know about the murder, in order, in detail. It was like this. Had some work in Oxenfurt, and I was coming home. Saw a plume of smoke rising over the city. Thought to myself, blast it, gonna miss him burn another hag. But the smoke wasn't coming from Hyrax Square. It was coming from here. See the soot stains? That's where they burned our sculptures. Folk gathered around the blaze and found Fabian here beside it. They'd already loaded him on the cart by the time I arrived. Talk to your neighbors. They see anything suspicious beforehand, hear anything? Claim not to. But even if they had, they'd not have helped. In Novigrad, folk give bleeding orphans in the street a white berth so as not to stain their poor lanes. Or do they care about some dwarf? Yeah, fair. I hate this place too. Fine, we've talked enough. Need to look around. Be my guest. Just beware of the dogs. Yes, boss. Right. Concerned citizen sermon, another one. Huh. Huh. Statues of the old gods. Nothing but women. Shapely ones. Fascinating. Huh. Oh, piss off, dog. Yeah, we'll take the runestone. Um. Bloodstains. That's where Fabian lay when they found him. Interesting. Murderer mm -hmm. dragged something in. Dragged something across the floor. Statues. More dragged it from Rock one wall to the floor. other repeatedly. Okay. What's inside? Can I go inside? Mind if I go inside the workshop? I've not even peeked inside since since they found Fabian. But I'll open it for you if you want. Yes, please. There's probably clues. And we like clues if we're going to catch a murderer. Right, what do we have? Loads of stuff. Stains, but not near 
enough to say he bled to death. Unless somebody got rid of the blood, left a few stains behind. Hmm. Furniture got knocked over. This looks like it was kicked. And we'll also take all of this. Because I'm a horrible, horrible person. Oh, we've got something here as well. What is that? Eyes. Humanoid. Completely rotten. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. What is this? Formaldehyde. Doubt Fabian used it. More formaldehyde. Huh. Hi. Right. Can we already know exactly what happened? Yep. Yeah. Already know what happened. Fabian was in the workshop. Murderer attacked him there. They struggled. Fabian was overpowered. Then tortured. For a time. I needn't know the details. Truth be told, I haven't the stomach for him. When it was over, the murderer dragged Fabian to the courtyard, then made a pyre of sculptures, set them aflame. But why? Why do all that? To teach a lesson. To him, you, the whole city. Yep. Oh. Already know. I went too fast. To teach. Come on then. Right, we've talked enough. Fine, we've talked enough. Won't learn anything else here. Take care. Cool. Let's go speak to the coroner. How far away is he? Quite far. Mm, I say quite far. He's not really that far. So up we go. Oh, good old Novigrad. This doesn't happen in Velen. God knows what happens in Skellige. We are going this way. Cool. That's it. Right. Up here. Here we are. Welcome, Master Witcher. Thanks. At least someone's happy to see me for once. Where is he? Here we go. Geralt, right? I'm glad you're here. Held off on the autopsy till you arrived. Nice oh, here we go. Especially given you didn't seem pleased about my previous visit. Because you came unannounced and in unfortunate company. I also had Reverend Nathaniel to contend with. Our spiritual caretaker has left the city on some important matter. And I know who you are, what drives you. I'm more than happy to aid your investigation. Oh, thanks, babe. Okay. Uh, you and Von Gratz don't get along. Why? By the way, you and Von Gratz don't exactly get along. Why is that? I had him sent to prison. You see, Joachim led the student protests in 1242. A senseless and brutal revolt. Right. People were dying, Witcher. Those who rejected liberty, equality, and fraternity would be found in the gutter come morning. Their throats slit from ear to ear with surgical precision. Joachim had been my favorite student, but... Alas, I had to do something. So I reported him. Then I left the university and found work in the morgue, where none care about my past. Whereas Joachim, oh, fate's ironies. Years later, he was appointed head of the very ward I had founded. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, look a little young to be Von Gratz's teacher. How old's Von Gratz? Fifty? Sixty? Fifty-three, I believe. Why do you ask? You look a little young to have been his teacher. Not surprising. For years, I've lived in the cold and dark, breathing the vapors of embalming fluids. In short, working with corpses extends one's life. Amusing, is it not? Hilarious. Uh, who's the victim? Who's the victim this time? Joris Aquinas, a lecturer in theology at Oxenfurt Academy. Found this morning at his home on a catafalque made of his books. Any titles in particular? It seems all the tomes dealt with the eternal fire. Treaties critical of the faith's doctrines. Yeah, mortal sin in Novigrad. Right, okay. Not fond of Nathaniel? Very few people are. He's cruel and capricious. He stormed in here once, grabbed a scalpel I was sterilizing over a burner, sliced my back with it to the bone, because I had forgotten to lock the storeroom. Hard to be fond of someone like that, wouldn't you agree? I'm telling you, this guy is the murderer. Let's start. Gladly. 
The wounds conform to the killer's modus operandi. The victim was bound and forced to drink formaldehyde. Next, the killer removed the eyes, placed burning coals in the sockets, then opened the rib cage and... What's this? A parchment made of human skin. A message from the murderer, the name of his next victim. Patricia okay. Vagelbird. Do you know her? Yes. Even went to her estate once with... Gotta find her, now. Okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh gosh, she's so far away. I don't know if I should quick travel. <laughs> I need to get out of the sea. And then we need to ride there, I reckon. Come on. Yeah, I don't know how quick travel will affect this. Don't know if I should do it. Oh, I think we have to ride a horse, you know. I think that's the safer option. I think that's the safer option. Let's run through the city. Till we can get outside. Get on our horse. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Come on, Roach. Come on. Come on. Right. Oh, fuck off. The more important things to deal with. Put your goddamn sword away. Come on. Don't need this GTA driving. Oh, we're taking a shortcut, because sod this. There's no need for me to take this long. Oh, fuck you. Haha, <laughs> sick. Here we go, awesome. Put your goddamn sword away. Come on, you can get up there. Stupid horse. Excellent. We're so close. Fuck the wolves. They're unimportant. Right. Come on, Roach. That's it. Let's keep going. Uh, how far are we? 170 feet. Awesome. We're getting there. Really getting there. Right, jump off. Let's go. In here. Awesome. Let me in, let me in, let me in. Oh god, who do I talk to? You. What do you want? Uh, I need to talk to Pat Patricia Vagelbud. Need to talk to Patricia Vagelbud. You think any bum off the street can... Her life's in danger. Let me in or have her blood on your hands. If you thought this up, and I'll let you in, I'll throw my ass out the door. Always thought a guard was supposed to protect his charge, not his ass. Huh. <laughs> so be it. I'll take you to Lady Vagelbud. Just no trickery. Understand? Here we are. Oh, Geralt, what a pleasant surprise. Not pleasant at all. I gotta see your mother. Her life's in danger. In danger? Come now, I saw mother this morning. She seemed sad, true, but in perfect health. Don't say things like this. I'm hunting a serial killer, and I've got reason to believe your mother will be his next victim. Why, even if it's true, our guards? He's exceptionally cruel when he kills, tortures his victims, cuts out their hearts. So let's see how she is, just in case. I find this all very hard to believe, but you appear to be quite serious. Please, follow me. Finally. A fire Fun. fit for Bellatane, except it's the wrong time of year. I mentioned Mother seems sad. Do you remember? 
In fact, she's in the midst of a crisis of faith. A rather serious one. We'd been to Novigrad. Mother had seen the pyres in High Rock Square, but had not a word on our way home. She had this doesn't give me confidence. Insignia's reliquaries gathered, taken outside and burnt. Then she locked herself in her room. We need to hurry. Yep. Whoa! Hear that? Calm, quiet. All seems to be in order. We should go in, just to be sure. Really yes. Fine. But wait here, please. Mother's certainly not in the mood for guests. She's gonna walk in, it's gonna be a corpse. Yep. Come on. Shit. Oh, fuck the dogs. Oh my god. Straight no. out! Murderer's still here! Are they still coming? No, good. Where the fuck has he gone? What? I'm not the murderer. Oh, fuck's sake. Now's not the time, people. God. No. My God. Hey. God damn it. This is not working. No. Put your sword away. We're not combating them. No, 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 no. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Get my sword out, please. Come on. Fuck's sake. Halt! Or I'll put a bolt between your eyes. Listen, you got the wrong guy. Save your trickery, taking you to the heiress. <sighs> well, killer's already escaped. Lead the way, hero. We got him, Lady Ingrid. Wasn't easy, but... Lower that crossbow before you hurt yourself. This man is innocent. Forgive me. I saw him running. Thought it was the killer fleeing. This fucking idiot. Him. And I'd have caught him if you hadn't gotten in my way. Out of my sight, at once! Mother! Why did he do this to her? Why? Um... Yeah, because she blasphemized the Eternal Fire. Because she blasphemed the Eternal Fire. Only thing that ties her to the other victims. Ingrid, I know this is a hard time for you, but... Usually the killer leaves a note on the body. A note indicating his next victim. May I? Very well. But you should be on your own. I do not wish to see her in this state. I do not wish to remember her like that. And let her be the last victim. Please. Yes, boss. She would have been if your fucking idiot guards hadn't gotten away. I'm gonna blow this. Broken fingernails. She defended herself. Must be why it took him longer, and why he almost got caught. Here it is. Sweet Nettie, crippled Kate's. Growing bolder. Not just the name, but the place too. Won't get away this time. Tracks just end. As if he vanished. Another sermon, yep. So Same sorry. Wounds as the previous victims. Examination would be a waste of time. Gotta get to crippled Kate's fast. I know, I'm just looting up. I wonder if we can like kill the guard. <laughs> just like smash his head in. I'm sorry, Ingrid. Greetings. No, yeah, you're very chirpy now. I'm glad. Good for you. Stupid fucking guards. Come on. Right. Out of my sight. 
we should kill you all. Again, I don't know how quick travel affects this. So I don't think we will. We're going to play it nice and safe. Right the way. Where is Roach? He's here. Come on then. Oh, no, I'm stuck again. Yep. Got that. Put your sword away. Thank you. We'll get Roach to come here. Or not. Okay, we'll keep going this way. We'll run a little bit. Here he comes. Where's my horse? He's in the bushes. Sick. Run, Roach. Yep, yeah, run, Roach. I can't believe... Bloody guards. Right. We've got this. Crippled cape. Wonder what, I mean, obviously it's going to be some sort of like tavern or something, but wonder why it's called that. Through the trees. We are 750 feet, so not close. Oh! God damn it. Right. We must get to the other side of the water. And then we'll call Roach back. Right, let's go. Assuming I need to go on this side. I don't actually know. World map. Yeah, it's in actual Novigrad. Yeah, okay. Okay, cool. Awesome. Right. Let's keep going. Awesome. Fuck my life. Right. Here we are. Yes, Roach. Just magically appear out of nowhere. Go, go. That's it. Keep going. Run, run, run. 400 feet. We are getting there. Show me what Come on. Got. No, don't show me what you've got. Just leave me alone. This is what we need. Yes. Right. Inside the city we go. Why? I don't understand why we can't sprint now. That really bothers me. It's probably is still quicker than running though. Come on. How much further have we got? We must be getting close. Where are you... You know. Give up. Give up with the horsey. There we go. Right. Pretty sure this is quicker. <laughs> right. To keep running, Geralt. You've got this. Come on. Uh, running all along the docks. Here we are. Get inside this goddamn building. Sweet Nettie, where is she? Upstairs. But she's with a very important client. Do not disturb them. No, nope, not a not a choice. Where? Are you Natty? No. Upstairs again? Must be. Where the fuck? No one will hear you, bitch. Not I've got to blow this. You though? Whole town will hear you in a minute. Yet again you disturb me. And I so dislike being disturbed. I was to play with sweet Nettie, render her not so sweet, but I shall see to you first. Right. Um Yeah, first I gotta know why. First gotta tell me why you do it. For pleasure. Satisfaction. 
Don't even start. Achievable with whores in a lot of ways. Many traditional. Doesn't take killing them. Trust me. Who said anything about killing? I could stop at a few burns. Third degree, but still. Mm, this rosy skin will roast quite well. Um, seeing your victims, you never stop at that. Spare me your lies. I've seen your victims. I know how they end. You don't stop. Not unless someone gets in your way. Like I'm doing now. What the fuck are you on about? Murder. You killed Fabian Meyer, Patricia Vagelbud, and many others. Bollocks. You're mistaken, vagrant. Um. Yes, who left the letter on Patricia's body? Found a message on Patricia's body. Led me here to crippled Kate's. To sweet Nettie. If you didn't leave it, who did? I don't know. But I see we must talk. Calmly. Who knew you'd be here? Strangely enough, I don't announce these outings far and wide. There's but one man who... That, that's impossible. He treats even corpses with kid gloves. The coroner said you were busy, that you wouldn't visit the morgue. Gotta go after him. Go. But to Warehouse 12 at the docks. He's there this time of day, procuring supplies. For Maldehyde. I shall stay here. I've unfinished business with Sweet Nettie. After all, I paid in advance. No, you won't. No, you won't. Yeah, can't allow. Then you'll pay again. For her, for all the other women you've tortured. Bad idea. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh no. Yes. Come on, unlock her. I know, you're free. You're all good. He asked if I did everything and I said, for the right price, of course. And then he smiled. Oh God, it gave me the shivers. And then he hit me. So hard I passed out. I was bound when I came to. And he was here in the poker, in the fire. <laughs> Calm down. He won't hurt you anymore. He won't hurt anyone. Well, we've got half the problem. Okay. Let's make our way to the warehouse. I'm so sorry, guys, someone rang me. Because, of course, they did. Right. Let's go head to the warehouse. Hell yeah, we'll take that stuff. Right, where was the stairs? Why am I stuck? <laughs> where the fuck is it? It's a doorway. That would help, wouldn't it? Right. Let's go this way. Cool. Oh my god, where the fuck is everything? Right, another doorway here. I'll just have a big old circle. <laughs> I'm so disorientated. Here. Yes, finally. God damn, okay. Right, thank you. Oh my god, of course it's that's locked. This is not going to plan. Here we are. Mm. Right. Let's catch this killer. I'm telling you, it's going to be that mortician guy. Well, not the mortician, the um, guy in charge of the morgue. Who sliced um, our dude's back open. I'll help you later, Hattori. Don't you worry, I'm not gone. I'm just a little tied up. Mm. Come on, we're so close. Yes, yeah, here.
run out of formaldehyde. I underestimated you. You almost caught me in flagrante delicto. Now you've seen through my bluff with Nathaniel. Although, you've not divined all, I see. Had you, you would have drawn your silver sword. Who, what are you? A vampire? Higher, of course. Oh, it's him. Huh. Got a reason for killing? A reason to torture? Hmm. I thought you'd figure that out as well. The symbolism is rather obvious. Coals for those who are blind to the fire. The egg of a salamander born of fire to replace their cold, doubting hearts. Fire down the throat that... Yeah, symbolism's clear. What's not is why a vampire would kill in the name of the eternal fire. Should be equally obvious. I concur with the church's diagnosis. Novigrad is a fallen city. Its population amnesiacs to the very concepts of decency and morality. So I decided to remind them in a manner they'd be certain to notice. Huh. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that top one. You're a sick fuck. I never expected you to understand. You're a cynic and an opportunist. I sensed it from the start. Ah, well. This conversation has grown unpleasant for both parties. We must move to the next item on the agenda. I last fought a witcher two centuries ago. I do hope I remember how it's done. And you? Have you faced one of us? No, you couldn't have. You would have survived. Hmm. Right. Do any vampire oil? Because I fought one of you bitches before. Yes, I do. Hell yes. Right. Nope. Let's get my thunderbolt. Not thunderbolt. Swallow. Back in here. Yes. Right. Awesome. Oh my god. Hit the torch, play. Idiot. Excellent. How's that vampire oil do? Not bad, it would say. Oh no. Come on. Shit. Heal up again. Damn, I tried to run out the way. Nope. Time to end this. <laughs> this is not going to plan. Let's drink some more swallow. Come on. Right. What we need to do? Yep. Get my life back up. Right. Uh, inventory. Where's... I need to cut in more vampire oil. Yep. Go on. Excellent. Oh my god. Ah, oh, I did it. Sick. Excellent. Look at all this. Ooh. Oh, that's sick. Okay. Put your sword away, please. Thank you. Well. I guess he is now dead. Not who I was thinking it would be, but okay. Now it makes sense why he's so ageless. Huh. Excellent. Awesome. There's so much to loot. 
Okay. I'm definitely going to have to uh, meditate when I'm outside. Yep, lots of bread and wine. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, what's this? The concerned citizen summon. Yep. Oh, wow, there is so much shit. Okay. What am I going to do all this? Excellent. Probably also explains why he's so quick. Right. That's it. Let's rest up. Uh, meditate. Just for an hour. There we go. Fantastic. Right. Let's head to the quick travel because there's no one to save now. Hopefully, there's nothing time sensitive. So, all that there. Where's the nearest one? Must be here. Okay. Excellent. Right. Just got a little bit of running to do. A little bit, he says. And then we'll head up to Dandelion. We'll see how Priscilla is. Hopefully she's still alive. Not too badly wounded. Hopefully. See if our medic guy's around. <laughs> Great. Thanks, buddy. Really now to make me feel good, don't you? Right. Keep going. Here we are. Sorry, kid. Right. In we go. Must be upstairs. Okay. Must be upstairs again. Yes. How is everyone? Wait, what? Okay, maybe they're not upstairs. Huh. Where the shit are they? In here? Yes. How's better, right? Y yes. Good, good. Did you take care of what I asked? Yeah. The witch's way. Thank you, Geralt. For me and Priscilla. Um, yeah, did my part now. You need to look after her. Did my part. Your turn now. Take care of her. Good care. I will. You'll see. Treat her better than the Dryads of Brockalon could. She's talking again. Nice surprise. Isn't it? Professor Von Gratz told me her wounds are healing faster than a troll's. Not the most flattering comparison, but encouraging. Maybe she might even sing again someday. Good. For now, we'll try performing as a duo. She'll play the lute, I'll sing. Dandelion and Calanetta. Got a nice ring to it, doesn't it? Sounds great. Good luck, Dandelion. On stage and off. Well, there you go. Can we talk to her? No. Okay, well that's fine. Quiet. Say no more. Get well soon. Thank you, let me leave. Cool. Well there you go, we smashed that. So if you have enjoyed guys, please drop the video like, it helps amazingly. If you're new and you're not subscribed but you'd like to, that'd also be amazing. And hopefully I'll catch you all in the next one. Bye guys.